Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Populous, the beginning. This is Olive Branch, and last episode uh, we finished off with number 18, Headhunter. Moving on to world number 19, Unlikely Allies this time. I'm going to start this one right away because there's only three challenges, really. Alright, so for the story. The Dakini have grown too powerful in this world, and we are allied with Chimara. This is the only map this is going to happen in, so we don't have to kill the Chimara, and we don't need them around to win the world either. So anyway, we have to defend them from destroying the, from the Dakini because the Dakini are going to attack them first. Anyway, I have three challenges to complete this video, and because one of them is related to time, I better get through this before I press OK. The first challenge is Hop Gadlin's Follow Me and I Will Make You Fishers of Men, where I have to have 12 preachers on the field at the same time. The second challenge is Can You Hear Me Now by Barry John where orders may only be given if the units are in line of sight with my shaman. This is going to be a little bit of a more of a realistic, I suppose, uh, takeover of the world. Lastly, it's Technological Stagnation by Zor, or Zore, where I only have five minutes to build up a starting base, and after that, no bu new buildings may be built. So I'm going to start right now. I have five minutes to build my base, and I'm going to make the most of it because this is in one aggressive world. Uh-oh. The Dakini have, are starting their attack on the Chimara. Not, a, not, not good, not good at all. So I'm gonna have to play defense. As soon as this is up, you'll see what my defense consists of. What I just got is a charge of the teleport spell. I can use this spell to move instantly to any location on the world, and this spell is only used in this map. So I better use it straight away. I'm going to teleport right over here. And even though this is counting off my time to build my base, I don't care. Right now, the, the uh, saving my allies is more important. So first things first, I'm going to hypnotize to get things out of the way. Get some infighting going on on their team. Blast. Use blast everywhere. It's critical I get the shaman in the water, though. Yes! Ah, oh, she got me in the water, too. Damn it. Well, tough. And that's it. I can't build anything else in my base. Five minutes are up. And I can't give orders while I'm out of sight, so my braves are kind of just standing around like idiots. The Dakini attacked the Chimara twice, and after that they'll attack us. So, here they go, they're setting up for a second run. So I'm gonna have to tell my shaman to stop walking over here. And I'll go teleport over here, again. There I am. So same as before. Hypnotize to cause dissension in the ranks and blast to try and get their shaman into the water. Hypnotize everywhere. Oh, almost. Ah, oh, and the Chimara got the bonus for that. Well, all these guys are hypnotized, I'm just gonna send it to counter-attack the Dakini. Because might as well, right? Oh, I, I couldn't... I couldn't cause as much destruction and death as I wanted. So, my mistake, the, the Dakini attacked the Chimara three times, and then they attack you. And as I learned painfully, Magical Shield does not stop uh, rebound from a blast spell. But I managed to get the enemy Shaman killed. Because I have two hypnotizes and I don't want the Dakini to get any stronger than they are now, I'm just going to hypnotize 
this band of people right away. If I can kill off the enemy shaman with these guys, I'll be very happy. And I'm getting my face kicked in, I'm dead. But so is the enemy shaman and she gets a hell of a lot more mana than I do. Which means I get to charge up and hypnotize fully. Or almost, anyway. And the Dakini are charging up again. So I better actually tell all of these guys in here to get inside huts and become preachers. A couple of warriors too, why not? It's going to be a bloody and offensive attack. Yeah, that'll do. Send everybody, I don't care. I'll just come up here. Mm, actually, no, I'm going to keep five of you in this hut, just in case. Yeah, here comes the Dakini once again. And I think this time they're coming for me. And here they are. Alright, no more time to waste. I think I have enough people. I'll counterattack them right now. And I definitely want to use magical shield on some of my preachers here. Kai. There. And lastly, it was hypnotize to draw their fire. And she used a, a tornado on herself. I don't know what the hell she was thinking. Oh, she's using counter hypnotize now. To be honest, I don't know who's who here. I'm guessing anyone who's not. Alright, I have to keep an eye on these guys. Guard. Guard. Oh, yeah, they're they're bad. Bad people. And here they come. Unless they're going for the Dakini, or the Chimara. In which case, yeah, it looks like they are. In that case, I'll tell my followers to unguard. Instead, to circle around this over here and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my last teleport to get over here and help out my bros and here they come I can't... okay. I couldn't seem to kill to blast the the, the, ch the Dakini as I wanted. So what is gonna happen is I hope these hypnotized guys can do the job for me. Get her guys. There you go. Perfect. Whoa, hey, hey, hey. I was wasting mana there. Uh, it's with two lightning bolts. Soka. Soka. Better 
this thing away from the water. Good, that's the way I like to do it. That is the way. Yes. That is a good attack. And keep rushing, don't stop. Ooh, that was nasty. Good, I don't care that I that that my groups are scattered, I managed to get her killed. Except I don't like the fact that this Yeah, okay, he stopped by himself, that's good. Alright, it seems I'm dealing good damage over here. Hmm, not as good as I thought. I've already I lost a lot of units on that. So now the objective is to tear down some Dakini huts. Mmm, that swarm. Things aren't going my way here. Ah, dear me. Alright, so that attack kind of went south in a hurry. And they're loading up on boats. I'm not sure what's up with that. Now, there is a stone head over here. It gives us a spell of volcano. But to get it involves, you know, would involve something like balloons, and I can't build a balloon hut anymore. And oh dear, oh dear, they're coming. Okay, I have to, I have to run back and marshal my, 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 uh, my, my men. Oh no, they are coming with balloons over here. Shit, guys, guys, you're within range now. Get the fuck over here. Ah, god, they're coming. Can't let them destroy the buildings entirely. Otherwise, that's one less hut I can use. Damn. And she just knocked herself in the water. That's fine by me. So a hut's been damaged. But the enemy is down. Alright, time for assault number two, and the Dakini are massing to attack themselves, so... Kai. I'm gonna have to set up my, my shields. This should do. You yeah. Go for us, my men. I'll stay behind to deal with the fallout. No. Anyone who's not busy, get to me now.
The Dakini all seem to be busy over there. I'm going to take this opportunity to destroy their base while they're just standing around. If they turn around, no, they're, they're going up to the Chimara. Perfect, perfect timing. I can use this time to destroy them completely. Oh dear me, she's here. Blast her, guys! Oh, that's bad. No, don't you dare. Damn it. Well, at least some good came out of that. Ah, this is going so badly over here, though. I have to get over there now. Man, who would have thought not being able to give orders from a, from a far away could be so far reaching? It's a damn good thing these guys were already over here. And my my preachers are doing a bang up job over here. Look at that. No, 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 no. Where are you guys going? Get get back over here. No, follow, follow. No, where are you all going? Get over here! Why don't you... They're on the idle mode. If the if Braves are idle for too long, they'll immediately run to the nearest uh, guard tower and or reincarnation center. So all these Braves are just sitting around waiting for me to come to tell them orders that they just gave up and went. Wow, how sad! The enemy shaman's over here all alone. Chamara are still alive, and in general, stuff has gone badly for the uh, the Dakini. Just because of those preachers. Ah, the Dakini gave up now. Everyone's lost, everyone's been killed. So now they're rushing to attack. Desperate last attempt. The last FU. No. Fuck you, Dad. And just to give, just to give a last flavor, I'll hypnotize this preacher. And that is it. We have completed unlikely allies, and for some reason, we got an angel of death out of it. I don't know. Don't ask me. Anyway, this has been uh, unlikely allies. You can see the Chamara are just like, eh, whatever, dude. But our own characters. They're very happy. So, this level took me about 45 minutes to complete. We won on most of the fights and we lost only 40. We destroyed the Kini with plenty of their followers, but we lost many of our own and we died 5 times, but we killed the enemy Shaman 10. So I feel pretty happy about that. Like I said, we completed 3 challenges this video, and I think it would all it would all worked out just fine. We had 12 followers, well, we had 12 preachers. Uh, we had people asking, can you hear me now? We can only send orders with our own followers. And we only had five minutes to build the base, which I was able to do, thank goodness. Anyway, this has been Unlikely Allies. I'm Olive Branch, and I will catch you next time. See ya!